Hello you guys, welcome to Journey with Char on this lovely Saturday. How are you doing? I pray everything is good in your neck of the woods. Um, here in California, we're still dealing with the fires. Gotta be really careful going out because it is completely like orange, but it lightning up outside, it was y'all, it was like orange. You can, you can look literally dead at the sun and it was just like a pretty orange, but air quality was not good so I'll be, I've been staying in when I do go out I do wear a mask um, but it is the N95 mask I can't just wear a regular mask because we have to be really careful but anyway other than that um, we're praying for our first responders and pay, praying for families that have been um, affected by the fires lost of loved ones lost of their homes we're still praying for these families and uh so just keep california oregon and i believe washington in your prayers because it is just the west coast is just really getting hit this year all right so anyway i come to you i've been posting pictures on my instagram and i said you know what mommy's opening up a package back there if you hear any noise back there but i wanted to show you this cute little halloween haul fall haul it's Halloween and fall together little items that I got here recently okay, first let me start off with this beautiful tray that I got from QVC this is by Tara um, and it is temptations and you guys this is the old world and it's a platter and it's a fall platter but this is a pretty big platter you can fit a turkey on here um, you can use this for all kinds of things y'all know entertaining period um, you can just have fun with this but I'm gonna get a little closer so that you can see how cute that tree is but look how cute that owl is sitting in his tree is he not adorable the fallen leaves the baskets of apples the cornucopia there we have the pretty little pumpkins that's got little carvings in them pretty little wagon and more um apples on the back of the wagon and different um squashes and pumpkins and just the tree is gorgeous i love trees and i love when they look like this in the fall and this is just so delightful just too cute and it is something that i will use for many years to come very very nice and then the next thing we got from uh qvc and this is also by temptations this is the boo fetty cookie jar is he not adorable i will put the link to each one of these items below but let's talk about how cute his little spider web knob is can y'all see that look how cute his little spider web so he has spider webs all around him and purple little bats and then her signature old world her little old world signature little flower prints and then the bats and the spider web and y'all look how easy this comes off and that's how deep he is you can fill this with cookies or any kind of little candy treats this is so cute and it does have that um, protection where it doesn't cling where you can go ahead on and just close it y'all look at that so we want to make sure we close it right and this is so cute it comes out every year well last year I saw it for the first time and it sold out when I saw it this year I said you know what I'm gonna have to go on and get this little guy he is so adorable he literally looks like a little sheet and it's just so cute isn't it with the little black handle and then it does come with the most adorable little cookie cutter which I thought was really kind and sweet to add that to her um, little set and then it also comes with this spectacular sugar cookie recipe which I thought was really cute and that's what they look like when you decorate them on the back and I will keep this in there thank God she has that plastic okay so the next things that I got this is Target so I'm gonna do it's all little Halloween spooky little stuff you guys and I'm even gonna include some things that I got from um, Dollar Tree in this also in this video as well these are by Wilton and how cute are these little ghost bags It's 20 of them and they're resellable that's why i liked them but do they not look just exactly like this buffetti cookie jar it is so cute these are just cute to take to give as gifts you make cookies and you can give them out as gifts or you can use these as a treat for yourself you go to the drive-in movies because y'all they are everywhere now here in southern california and you can put your own treats in here so you can save some money and enjoy your film okay enjoy the movie you're watching so yes that is by wilton and it is a set of 20 that comes in these and i think these were 3.99 they are so cute next thing i got here 
this adorable cookie cutter and I believe this one is by I don't know where it is but I got it from Target so yes it's over in the bake section and then this one they had the witch and um, I think a skull but I didn't see those so I got the pumpkin and the ghost which I love the most anyway and this is the pumpkin one and these are the cute the real easy to cut out you can just press down because it has that rubber lining so I love those okay that's the next thing next thing I got y'all I saw these on Instagram and everybody was posting that's oh my gosh those are so adorable every year Target has the cutest little holiday mugs and so so does um um uh Crate and Barrel and also William Sonoma but we know these are more affordable than Crate and Barrel and William Sonoma they're five bucks each and they are just too cute look at the little hands and the little mouth and I just thought that they were just so adorable and I saw y'all them on Instagram and I promise you I did not see these in the store I went to four different targets did not have these in the store my son went into to the store yesterday and Josh was like yeah they have those ghost mugs I'm like are you kidding me so he got a few of these for me so I did I'm just showing you too they're so cute if you have these at your coffee station just even cute look how cute it looks with the um cute buffetti is that not adorable just too cute and fun. So we got these adorable coffee mugs or apple cider mugs or hot chocolate mug or just milk, whatever you want, right? So adorable. Okay, the next mug that I got here is the Boo Mug, y'all. I saw this and had to get it. The Boo Mug is too cute and I love the fact that the Boo is in like gold leaf. It is so pretty and it's a nice size mug and you just get your hand in there and just have a good time y'all really cute to put at your coffee bar the next mug we have here speaking of all the mugs since i'm holding it y'all this is the happy fall y'all oh my goodness this is so cute i love the fact you can probably make this yourself but i love you see how the cup has like indents in it like it's not a perfect mug it's like a pretty fall color like that burnt orange rust on that white it is so beautiful y'all this was the last one. She was looking all over for these. This was the last one she grabbed it. Okay, and the next thing we got from Target are these cute um, made good, these cute, and I just love the color of it. I wouldn't even change the color of it. I just think it's so cute and I love that it says family on it. So yes, I got this for $3 in the $5 section. Y'all know how they do them $5 sections in Target. Honey, y'all better go early. Let me tell y'all, them women, they be serious about that $5 section, honey. Okay, so then the next things that we have here. So my son, I saw this on Instagram. Let me pull them closer. I saw these on Instagram. And I said, oh my gosh, you have got to be kidding me. Joshua went the other day for me. And he said, I do not see what you're talking about. Him and the guy, the young guy from um, Target that works in Target were looking all around for these. And he said, maybe we don't have them yet. I think we'll be getting them soon. So anyway, I went back in yesterday and I found them. And they, it was probably two more of these left. This one was the last one and it was one more of that. I could not believe it. Anyway, these are the Pyrex Simply Store containers. Look at how that one says Boo with the little black cat and then on the it says Boo and Spooky. No, Scary and Trick or Treat. It does have Trick or Treat on there. Can y'all see that? It is so cute. And every year Pyrex does this. They pull out um, little festive um, for the holidays they pull out these cute little festive storage containers people use them they open them up and they use them for the parties and um, you can use them for anything you know basically whatever you store your stuff in I like to put like if I make cookie dough I love putting them in there and you can freeze these you can I don't think you can bake it I'm not for sure but look at the little ghosts y'all and the beds all the way around I'm done <laughs> this is so cute and I think my favorite ghost was, let me see if I can find her. Look at that one eye ghost, honey. There we go. My favorite ghost was the cute little ghost with the, with the glasses. So yes, the little spider and the moon and the stars. It's just the cutest little thing, all for fun, y'all. And then the last one that I have here um, is the, this one has the black top and then this one is with the pumpkin and the leaves all the way around. And the pumpkins are different, as you can see. 
they all have different little faces. This little piece is heavy. It's just so festive and so cute, so adorable, right? Okay, next thing y'all, I'm going to do a Dollar Tree haul and I wanted to show you, I stopped by a Dollar Tree and they had so much cute stuff. So I wanted to show you really cute. I could not stand it, I had to get it. Um, when Joshua was younger, oh, he loved Halloween putting on his little cute little Halloween outfit and this just brought back memories. But when I saw these little plates, cause everything at the Dollar Tree is $1. They have stepped up their game every year with the cute little Halloween design decor. I just think it's always good to have party favors on hand because you never know and you can store these things away you never know what you might need. So when I see these little things, honey, she grabs them and stores them away with her paper plates and napkins. So anyway, let's get started. Look at this cute boo. Is he not amazing? And I want to show. This is the napkin that matches. When I saw that, I love that they've incorporated purple in Halloween um, colors. But it is just so cute. It's just enchantment of a child's imagination. And this is just so cute. Y'all, who in the 80s remember Raggedy Ann and Andy's Halloween special that came on every year with that dog riding a skateboard and it was a Halloween It was a um, um, Jack-o-lantern. He was sitting on a porch of an old home and he was crying pumpkin seeds if you remember that I know how old you are <laughs> That was my favorite Halloween special y'all know we had the best Halloween specials in the 80s anyway So this is another one how cute is that Joshua was actually that when he was younger I made him a little ghost outfit it was the cutest thing ever but how cute is that little Frankenstein that little witch and that ghost so adorable and I love it because you can put all three of these out and look it has with the matching napkins is that not the cutest thing ever for a Halloween party um, school at school Halloween party at your house Whatever, it is just the cutest little set. So, so far, I've showed you the, the um, pumpkin and the witch and the a ghost and Frankenstein. And then last, for the paper plates, I got this one. It says, Happy Halloween, boo. It's so cute. So adorable with the candy corn, which I love candy corn. A lot of people hate candy corn, but for some reason, I love it. My mom hates it. <laughs> but anyway, yes. So, how adorable is that? So cute. And I love, they had just put them out, y'all. I mean, they were stocking the shelves and I went ahead on and grabbed that. And let me show you the other things that they were stocking. I said, they are going to be gone. I thought this was the cutest thing because it reminded me of the Wizard of Oz when the witch's <laughs> legs were sticking out from under the house. But anyway, it is a garland and how cute is that? It is so adorable. And so I went and got that. Yes, grown woman got that, don't have grandkids yet. We'll have, and I think whenever I have grandbabies, I'll have like little fall um, time um, a harvest party and we'll put these little cute little things out. I just think it's, it's, I don't take Halloween the way some people take it. It's just a child's imagination, child. But anyway, look at this trick or treat. Is that not the cutest thing? And what I loved about the trick or treat um, sign, this one, look how the cat is elevated a little bit off of the um, little board and this is like a plaque plank board y'all this is so cute how adorable is that is that not the cutest thing ever 99 cents for that let's just so let's just show the witch's legs again can y'all see that too cute and then the next thing we have here the next thing we have here when I saw this little sign I thought this was so adorable Look how cute that little trick-or-treat sign is. I would have loved this as a child. So bright and colorful and glittery. Just so cute and enchanting. I just think it's just, it's just so cute. Just adorable. Then the next one I have here is this one. It says, beware. I hope y'all can see that. Y'all see that? Beware. <laughs> just so adorable. They are doing so good with the black cat. They are doing yeah. so right with the Casper. I'm going to bring this up close so you guys can see it from this angle. Just so adorable. And that purple that they added is just so cute. And then last with the Halloween decorations that I just could not. <laughs> the boo 
is so adorable, right? How cute is that boo sign? So adorable. I love it, y'all. I love it. So yeah, so I got all of these cute things here all from Dollar Tree. You better go if you're really looking for Halloween decor. I wonder if they had cups. I bet you they did. And I didn't see them. I'm going to see if the other ones have them. But I bet you they had cups. They had just started putting them out. So I might even drive back out to see if I see cups. Can we talk about how cute this little guy is? I saw him last night and got him. Can we show you what he does? He is just the cutest little thing. Okay, hold on. Is that not the cutest thing ever? Oh my gosh. Okay, now we want you to be quiet, baby. Okay, yes. So, oh my gosh, so cute, right? Long as you don't hear this thing come on in the middle of the night by itself. But yeah, <laughs> Joshua had a toy when he was a little boy, y'all. And it made noises like that. And it was two little men that used to fight. They were two little karate men fight at one end. He, him and a friend could play the little toy. But anyway, to make a long story short, he had a toy. And the only way that it would go off is if, if it was on the little thing that it needed to be on for them to fight. Y'all, in the middle of the night, I promise you, I would hear that toy in a distance. Yeah. And I was like, what in the world is that? I would get up and search all around my house looking for that toy. And he was not connected to the thing he was supposed to be connected to. So I said, that little thing is haunted. So as long as he does not make noises, I'm good. But yes, so that is everything for the little Halloween. All right, you guys. So I took these out. I'm going to hold these ever so carefully because as y'all can see they're very they're glass okay so if you are not familiar with my channel from the past if you paid attention um when i i use a lot of glass cutting boards i do have wood ones but these i use um a lot of times my old ones that i've been having more than 12 years they're over 12 years old and they're by um what's her name Valerie. they're by valerie par hill from QVC and that's Valerie and the par is P-A-R-R -R, and then Hill by QVC, QVC from Q, um, Valerie Par Hill from QVC. And I have been buying her items for years. And I have cutting boards that are literally 12 years old. If you ever seen any cute little cutting boards on my cooking um, videos, you would know those are the Valerie Par Hill cutting boards. Anyway, she came out with some holiday ones. And we're starting with the Christmas. I should have started with the Thanksgiving ones. But anyway, I am so, when I saw this one, I said, oh my goodness, I got to get this. Look how beautiful that cardinal is. I have never seen a cardinal with my naked eye. I've only seen them on television here in Southern California. We don't have cardinals. At least I have never seen a red bird unless it was in the zoo or something like that. Um, but I've never seen a live, car like a, a wild cardinal. And I know that they are a lot back east, down south and midwest, but we don't have them much here unless they're up north. Anyway, this bird is absolutely beautiful. It's one of my favorite birds that I've never laid my eyes on. And I just think this red bird is just gorgeous gorgeous and it looks so pretty on this cutting board i love that she used that stripe back that beautiful background color to bring out his red it's just so pretty and so this one is the cutting board and i will link below link put the link below so that you can see um the sizes and everything but it does have footing and i promise you i have a set of her um cutting boards and they're over 12 years old they last forever when you take good care of them the ones that i have are seasonal and i pull them out each season i will have probably mommy pull out the one that i've been having for 10 years but let me give this one to mommy this was a set of three and the next one and these are perfect for if you're entertaining and um for charcuterie boards charcuterie boards if you're entertaining Oh, perfect to have all three of them out. It looks like a, a nice sweater, right? But that is that print, and this is green, red, and white. Isn't that pretty? And this one has the footing 
on the outside uh, on the back as well mommy that's another one and then lastly this beautiful gingham one and it is so pretty this one's black would you say that's black or is that like a blue I don't know it's like a black it's black I think but y'all it's so pretty can you imagine different foods on there cheeses fruits and how the color would just pop from the background and you can use this one year-round actually um, but I just think it's just so beautiful perfect for Christmas and perfect for a Christmas party Christmas entertaining Christmas dinner um, charcuterie whatever even if you want to use it for Christmas breakfast whatever it's just a beautiful board to cut up your vegetables put it on a beautiful little easel thing and set it up in your kitchen in a corner some people do that whatever you choose but this is a very good solid glass mama I'm telling mama to hit the glass the camera so the the view would get better she gonna hit the glass okay <laughs> anyway so that's that one and that was for a set of three so now we're coming to this one. Oh my goodness when I saw this I thought it was so beautiful this one says joyful harvest and look how beautiful that decoration is look at those pumpkins in the corner there the stripes with the lace the beautiful sunflowers and the different gourds and what are those potatoes or acorns look at walnuts walnuts and pumpkins and corns it's just festive and I love how she put that stripe background and it's just so vibrant and just lovely y'all this is just really, really pretty. So this is one of my favorites. That's the one she had. Now this is the one she, she just put out. Now the one that we've been having, I'm gonna show you, y'all, this thing is over 10 years old. It's actually over 12 years old. She did do it a little different with the corners. No, it's the same. So this is the one that I've been having over 12 years. It looks like she made them a little bigger. Mm -hmm. She did, she made them a little bigger, so I'm comparing them. And this is the one over 10 years old. Over, it's about 12, 13 years old, y'all, honestly. Look at the colors, are still vibrant, everything. And then I'm gonna turn this around. You can see it's still, it's still doing its thing. And this is the one I have out right now in my kitchen, okay? And this is the new one. Isn't she pretty? Oh my goodness, just look at those pumpkins. Just really, really pretty. This is the green gingham one, it's just green. Green is one of my favorite colors. Just look how pretty that looks with that fall color in the background. Just so pretty. And this video, this camera's really not doing justice. Let me see if I turn it this way. Y'all can see the green. Can you see that beautiful, beautiful like forest like green? It's just so pretty and just listen to that. It's a nice thickness. This is not a thin fragile board. You still have to be careful but it's not a thin, fragile board. And last but not least, y'all finna love this. If you love the, the traditional fall colors, y'all, look at this one. Isn't that beautiful? And this comes with that set. So this one, that gingham one I just showed, and the pumpkin one, all comes in a set of three. How pretty is this? And this one has that light green stripe and then it's got the green and the different thin stripes and then the orange and the yellow. It's just so fall and pretty. And just look how pretty it looks with the background here. It's just so pretty. Can you imagine setting something out and just putting all your fruits, your desserts. One of these you can use for desserts. The other one you can use for cheese and crackers and fruits. And, when, and I just bring them out every holiday. I, and my seasonal ones I bring them out. Whatever season it is, I bring them out. And they're so pretty. Even if you have it up in the corner in your kitchen, just sitting over in the corner with some flowers around it, little pumpkins and some leafing coming around from under there, y'all. Just so cute, okay? So that is everything. Did I get anything else? Oh, one more thing I wanted to show you that I did get from Target. And I got from the Dollar Tree. I got this mitten from the Dollar Tree. I saw this one, thought about mommy, so I grabbed that for her. And then I got these from 99 cent store the other night. I just thought these were just too cute. And then you guys, these from the 99 cent store. Y'all, look at what the 99 cent store is doing. Look how thick this is. And just so beautiful. So I got a set of these. And then I also got a set of these in 
this print in these and then this in this print. If you understand what I'm saying, you will see in the background. But yes, isn't that beautiful? I love this rich, dark, deep color. Y'all, this year I've just been loving these dark colors. This mitten is just so adorable. It's thick, easy to just grab whatever you need to get and just look at the gold in there. Isn't that pretty? It's just 99 cents. And look at this. Look at that. I mean, they used to be rinky dink at the 99 cent store. Now they're just like, and these were 99 cents, right? And then the last thing that I got from Target that will complete this haul is a cute little welcome sign. I thought it was so cute. This would be cute on a foyer in front of something or you put it on something. Uh, just be creative. I'm going to find something that I'm going to put this on, child. Trust me, she will. But I just love the way it's written. It's so pretty and then last but not least i wanted to show you guys these adorable little um soap dispensers that i got from bath and body works the other day i went in and i had an award for 16.95 i couldn't find nothing for 16.95 and one of the ladies in the store i'm not gonna say her name because i think they can get in trouble but she said you can buy something and then bring it back and you could just pay the difference so that's what she did she went i didn't like what i got but i went and i took it back and I was able to pay the difference. I only paid $5 difference because it was $16.95 and these little things are $10. But look at the leafing in there. Isn't that pretty? And I got the candle holder coming. I had to order online and uh, I'll show you that when I get it. But y'all, this is just so cute. And then, oh, got the candle holder for this one. Is that not the cutest soap dispenser holder? Y'all. So cute with the little bear and the little chipmunk or squirrel and the fox. Some all my favorite stuff, deers, trees, love it. So cute, right? Adorable. So that is everything that concludes this fun, cute little Halloween haul, fall haul. I hope you guys enjoyed it as much as I did showing you the little whatnots that I've been picking up along the way. Y'all, she got to watch it. This time of year, you can spend a lot of money, so you got to be careful. But anyway, thank you so much for tuning in to Journey with Shar. And if this is your first time ever seeing my channel and you like what you see, please hit that subscribe button. Also, make sure you hit the notification bell. Every time I upload a new video, it will alert you and let you know that I upload a new video and you guys can come check me out thank you so much for tuning in i hope everything is well in your neck of the woods you all please choose to be kind kindness is always the better way to go and remember always trust god keep him first and he'll always lead you in the right direction thank you so much for tuning in you all be blessed i'll see you soon bye bye